everyone. This is my son, Chris. He's taking his PSAT on Monday. Well done. Ah, George Watkins. Very impressive, Chris. You're taking the first step towards college and a very bright future. And this is God, not you. You two know each other? Yes. He's the so-called judge that threw me in jail after I beat that speeding ticket. You were in contempt. She still is. Look, OK, that is ancient history. All right, I'm past that. I'm here today for my children. Well, if your son is doing well in school, this is an opportunity for him to meet the right people. He's doing very well, thank you. He's working on a merit scholarship. She might as well have said I was working on a cure for cancer. Really? A merit scholar, huh? That's right. Well, you're obviously trying to better yourself. How about we let bygones be bygones? Bye. Gone. That's how proper black people say, let's squash this. Chris, just make sure you study a little every night and get eight hours of sleep before your test. Don't cram. It's a surefire way to fail. OK, great. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. I don't think he means it. Hello. Back at home, if the judge had been around, he'd be holding me in contempt. Boy, what are you doing? Didn't you hear what the judge said? You need to go to bed. But, uh, but nothing! Stop studying so you could do well on that test! First time I ever heard that. 